most museums on Earth. By day, visitors come to see the treasures within, but by night, it's a different story. children approaching. They're here. Welcome to the British Museum. You are about to embark on a wondrous adventure, a night you will remember for the rest of your lives. Now, let me introduce myself to you. I'm Agatha, your tour guide. I'm much like the tour guides you see around during the day, except I only do the night shift. Now, the bad news is that I'm dead, but the good news is I'm the perfect person to guide you through this night. Now, I'm looking for some brave children to become guardians of the museum. What are your names? Natasha. Vanessa. Stacy. And you're from Newcastle. Newcastle. Now, you must be wondering why you've been summoned here in the middle of the night. Listen carefully. You have just one night to discover the secrets and mysteries of a relic held deep within these walls. You will face three challenges. Each challenge will unlock a vision about your relic. Pass a challenge and you will all see the vision. Fail and the vision will be revealed to just one of you and you will have only their memory to rely on. Your knowledge of the three visions will be tested in the final battle when you come face to face with the Dark Lord. Succeed and you will become guardians of the museum and receive the Golden Scarab. Fail and you will become relics yourselves and part of the museum forever. Agatha! That's the Dark Lord. He knows you're here, and he'll be sending his dark forces to seek you out. We must keep moving. Follow me, chaps. Run as fast as you can, Agatha. My dark forces are coming for the children. <laughs> should be safe here for a while. Now, to discover the identity of your relic, you must first unlock a vision. And to do that, you must complete a challenge. Now, your first challenge... Did you hear something? No. <sighs> Thought it might have been the dark forces. Now, your first challenge takes place in the home of this fellow. This is the Aztec god Shukoatl, or, as he's better known, the Fire Serpent. Now, let's hope you three have some snake-like moves, as you're going to need them in your first challenge. Right, let's get out of here. To get there, you must follow my instructions. Hold on nice and tight. Now, are you ready? Yes. Jolly good, this is going to be such fun. Let's go. Is everyone all right? Is everyone here? Yeah. One, Hi. two, three of you. Right, now, where are we? Oh, oh, I recognise this. This is the Aztec Pyramid of Tenochtitlan. Now, this used to be a very beautiful pyramid until Hernan Cortes and his Spanish army ransacked the whole city and took all of the treasure. Now, the only treasure that's left is on the other side of that wall. You're looking for five pieces of turquoise. Now, turquoise looks like this. Isn't it beautiful? Yeah. So, you're to dive through here, one at a time, you find a piece of turquoise, then you place it in this wagon, and the other teammates pull it through like this. Then, you do an action roll underneath this wall. You must have all five pieces of turquoise and all three team members on this side of the wall at the end of 90 seconds in order to pass. If you pass, all three of you will get to see the vision. Now, if you don't pass, I'm afraid only one of you will see the vision. Okay. okay. You think you can do it? Yeah. Yes. Right, who's going to go first? Me, me. Lovely. Now, okay. you can go in three, two, one, go. Come on, Tasha! Tasha! Sit, everyone, take your team on. Come on, Tasha, you can do it! Can you see any turquoise? Remember, Tasha, you're looking for five pieces of turquoise. Can't see it anyway. Everywhere. 
30 seconds to go. Get behind those rocks. Come on. Behind the rocks. Yeah, just look everywhere. Um, never two coins good. Turn them no. are in there, Vanessa. You've just got to look under things. Move things around. Come on, let me go. Don't worry. Found it. Very well done. Straight in the wagon. Straight in the wagon. Put it back. Come on, Tia. 10 seconds to go. Come on. Next one. <laughs> team. team, that's very disappointing. Oh. oh no, only three pieces of turquoise. We needed five. Who's on the other side? Is it Natasha. Natasha? Right, let's get her back. Natasha. Come on, out you come. Hey. Oh, that's very disappointing. Team, what happened? I don't, I don't know. know. It was it was just, just like, I think we each took too long looking for the. Like, it the it was pretty hard to find. But not to worry, there's lots of challenges to come. But for now, you have to choose as a team who's going to see the vision. So who's it going to be? Stacey said it. Stacey, Stacey yeah. And she uh, took the last Stacey. time. Yeah. And she's uh, got the best okay. memory. Right then, you two, that means it's back to the museum for you. Come like so. And make sure you don't touch anything while I'm away. I'll be back shortly. Hold on. <laughs> To come back. So, Stacy, yeah. you are seeing the vision alone, which means you are the first in your team to discover information about okay. the relic you seek. Well, now, to unlock the vision, we have to stand in a special formation. So, with our heels together, standing up straight, I'm going to hold on to my torch and I'm going to say a little rhyme. Just okay. do as I say. So, secrets and mysteries we are ready to receive. Deep breath in, hold on tight. Close your eyes and see. The vision begins. Where are we? The ancient kingdom of Benin. They're making something from molten brass. But what is it? An image of the Oba, their ruler. Look, he's receiving the plaque. He says the art of his kingdom is the envy of the world. One of many, these beautiful objects depict the king and the people of Benin. The image is fading. We're coming back to the museum. Back to the museum. Back to the museum. <sighs> so, Stacy, remember your entire team is relying on you. OK, where, where are they? Team? We're team? Here, we're here. Quick, quick, quick. Now. Stacy, tell them everything that you remember. Stacy, it was in the kingdom of Benin, and there was a king or ruler called Orpa, and they made him like a plaque out of molten brass, and he said it was the greatest art, and everyone would envy him, and they made loads of them, like different ones. Maybe the Benin plaques are the relics that you're yeah. looking to find out yeah. about. Yes, try and remember it. Because remember, the story of the Benin plaques isn't yet complete. You must unlock more visions, and to do that, you must complete more challenges. I can sense the dark forces. They're descending on us. We're not safe here any longer, chaps. Follow me. Quick, quick! Yes, watch out for my dark forces. And be careful not to forget all that Stacy told you. <laughs> right. Oh, phew. There is a dark force very, very close by. I can sense it. Can anyone see it? No. Take a good look around. Can you see it anywhere, chaps? No. No, thank you enough. Take a look. Make sure it's over there. <gasps> where, where, where? <laughs> Shh. Okay, he can't get us if we're up here. We just have to stay really, really quiet. The thing about dark forces is they like the dark, and sometimes it gets very quiet. It's a trap! <laughs> run, run, run! My dark forces are everywhere. Goodness me, that was a bit of a close thing, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah. It's too close. Oh, my heart was racing. I'm shaking. 
Well, I think we're okay for now. Take a look at this door quickly. It's actually a false door. So it was only used by the Egyptian spirits going in and out of the tomb of Ptah Shepses. Try saying that without your teeth in. <laughs> now, to unlock your second vision, you must travel all the way back to ancient Egypt. Come along, chaps. Now, hold on tight. Come along. Are you ready? Yes. Off we go. Goodness me. We all here? Yeah. One, two, three. Approach! Right, quickly, quickly. Is that the entertainment? Oh, splendid. I've been looking forward to this. I am Cleopatra, Queen of Egypt. And who might you ladies be? I'm Stacy. I'm Vanessa. I'm Natasha. Ah, I hope you are as clever as you are beautiful. Let us begin. I will give you some statements about our great Egyptian culture. It is for you to decide whether they are true or false. In each of these pots is an asp. It's a tiny, tiny snake with a very sharp bite. If you think the statement is true, then place your hand in the true pot. If, however, you think it is false, the false pot. If you get it correct three times, then you will pass. However, if you get it wrong, you will receive a nasty bite. Get three of those and you will fail. Are you ready? Yes. Yes. Then <laughs> we shall begin. True or false? A pyramid in ancient Egypt has three sides. Speak up. Um, false. Thinking that it's false. False, you say? Yes. Yeah. Why do you think this? Because it's a square base pyramid. It's a square base pyramid uh, with the long sides. <laughs> Please come up and place your hand inside the false pot. <gasps> be brave now. Do it. If you're sure you're right, there'll be no bite. Congratulations, you are correct. Next statement. Egyptian men used eye makeup and moisturizer. Is it true, it's true. or false? It's true. It's true. It's true. Oh, you seem very sure. Because it was a fashion in your times. If you think it is so, approach. <laughs> are you feeling um, brave? No. <laughs> Wonderful! You have two correct. You are very good thinkers. You only need one more to pass. Next statement. Egyptians worshipped a god called Trutus. He had a man's body and a pig's head. True false. 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 It wasn't a pig. False. Speak up, ladies. False. It's false because it wasn't a pig's head, it was a bird head. If you think it is so, approach and place your hand in the false pot. Very, very confident. Yes! <laughs> Wonderful! Bravo! That's three correct, which means you have passed. Now you may leave. Ladies, ladies, quick, quick. Well done! No snake bites at all. You must be pleased with yourselves. <laughs> now, that does mean that all three of you can see the vision. So, we hold on to the torch. I will say a small rhyme, just do as I say. So, heels together, standing up straight, like a piece of string is pulling you up to the ceiling. Secrets and mysteries we are ready to receive. Deep breath in, hold on tight, close your eyes and see. I sense we're leaving Africa, but where are we going? Oh, we're here at the British Museum. Look, one of the Benin plaques. There's a date. They're exquisite. These can't have been made in Africa. Is the Victorian expert suggesting the Benin people were uncivilized? They must be European. No, he was wrong. Of course they were made in Africa. The image is fading. We're coming back to the museum. Back to the museum. Back 
to the museum. Oh, goodness me. Right, well, that was the second vision of the Benin plaques. Uh, now, you all saw it that time. Yes. So what do you remember? It was taken to the British Museum in 1897. And 1897. And the man was saying that it couldn't be African because um, they wouldn't be able to create such a wonder. Now, who did he think? Europe. It must well, be who? European. European. But it was actually from Africa. Jolly good. Now, you must keep all that knowledge in your heads, chaps. Yeah. Knowledge is essential if you want to stand any chance of defeating the Dark Lord. Remember, you will have to answer three questions correctly to receive the Golden Scarab and become guardians of the museum. Fail, and you will belong to him forever. There's only one vision left to unlock. Can you feel that? Yeah. The Dark Forces are near. Got to keep moving. This way. Follow me, chaps. So, all three of you have seen the vision, but will you remember everything? It's way past your bedtime. You must be getting tired. <laughs> right. It's much brighter in here. The dark force is like the shadows, but keep quiet. You have just one vision left to unlock. I don't want them catching us now. Now, take a look behind you. This stone relief is a sort of giant comic book telling the story of a great Assyrian king on the hunt for ferocious lions. Now, you do well to take note, as in your final challenge, you may well find yourselves hunting. Hmm. Gather round. Come along, hold on tight. Jolly good. Are you ready? Yes. Off we go. <sighs> oh, jolly good. You're getting the hang of this time travel yeah, thing, yeah. aren't you? Right, now, where are uh, we? Well, I can tell by the heat that we're somewhere hot. It must be Assyria. Oh, look, look. It's an archaeological dig. Oh, what fun. Oh, gather round. It's a bit like a big treasure hunt. That is actually your final challenge, to find the Assyrian treasure hidden underneath this sand. You will use these special archaeological tools. Now, there is a technique to it. Let me show you. Gather round. Let me squeeze in here. OK. First of all, dust away with the brush. Then you use your trowel to lift your treasure out very, very gently. Okay. Does that make okay. sense? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. So you take those. Okay. Now, one of the problems with being an archaeologist is the creepy crawlies. Oh. Oh. And I think I have noticed one or two scorpions lying oh. underneath this sand. Now, if you come across three scorpions before you find three pieces of treasure, then I'm afraid you fail. Tools at the ready? Yeah. Off you go. But right, this, this one here. That one over there? Um, I don't know. Why are you going for that one? Because it's right at the very end and everything else is yeah. over there. You know what you might find quite useful? Uh, There's a map behind you. I mean, it, it might come in handy, I don't know. Don't lie well, that's already been dug up. Yeah, it has, We need it? to find some... I'll try this one. Well, okay. try and cross first and then after we can cross try a that one. Nice and close. There's something there. Something there. There's something there, what is it? <laughs> oh, oh, get away, girls. That's one scorpion. Oh. Now, two more of those, and I'm afraid it's curtains. Try this one here with the cross. So yeah. We can cross. Careful. Brush very gently, <gasps> very gently. It's a scorpion. Oh, no. I think. Oh. You're brushing. It's <laughs> oh, me. How oh, terrifying. Oh, so oh, scorpions. Oh, I can't believe it. Two scorpions. That's not very good, is it? Now, you know what one more of those means? We've, We've failed. failed. Exactly. So, Let's keep calm. Let's have that one. Right. One I here? mean, it's in the centre. Yeah, we it's haven't tried the map. it. It's a cross, so we don't know what cost Just to try. Yet, We're trying this one here. Yeah. Jolly go. Oh, <gasps> yeah! Yes! Yes! Very good. You got down. <laughs> very, very delicately. Remember how old this is? There we Whoa. go. Remember. Whoa. There we go. Remember, yes! this could be thousands of years old. We need right. two more of those and um, no more scorpions, please. Try this one here. Try that one. That one. That one. Do you okay. think? Don't you think? Yeah, try. Yeah, okay, think. very gently. Remember, Careful. leveling the techniques. Let's <gasps> hope you're on a roll. Oh, there's, oh, something. there's something. No, it's... Yes! Yes! yes. Very well yes. done, team. Very well done. Dust it away. I think it might be another bracelet. Yay! Come on. Look at yes. that. Oh, look at that. That's yeah. beautiful. Gorgeous. Now, this is very important. You have had two scorpions and two pieces of treasure. So it all rests on this last choice. So what okay. are you going to go for? Cross. This one's got... And that one's a cross, so... Mm. 
Oh, but I think we should try a look. Try. Maybe try this one, Stacy. Do you want to try this one? No, should we that try one. the middle try one? Try that one. Oh, let's just hope. <laughs> Fingers crossed. Please, is there something? There must be something about. Fingers me. crossed. Yes! Yes! Oh, oh no! very, very yes. well done, team. Okay, yes! Let's very probably. gently, please. Pass it to me. You mustn't damage it. There we go. Oh. Very well done. <laughs> Ladies, you've passed. Yes. Well done. <laughs> How do you feel? I'm glad we won. Well, you did very, very well. Two scorpions. That was a bit scary. Did they make you yeah. jump? Yes. Because yes. they came right yeah. A pass means all three of you can see the vision. Ladies, quick, quick. Put your ankles together, please. Standing up straight. Follow my rhyme. Secrets and mysteries we are ready to receive. Deep breath in. Hold on tight. Close your eyes and see. The vision begins. I said we're still here in the museum. An expert. What can he see? They're all scenes of a rich African culture. There's no other explanation. They have to be made by Africans. Images of the Oba's people trading the riches of the African forest with the Europeans. This was a culture as rich and as organized as our own. He's beginning to realize. Listen. The Benin people created a civilization just like ours. He's right, and these plaques prove it. The image is fading. We're coming back to the museum. Back to the museum. Back to the museum. <sighs> so, chaps. That was your third and final vision of the Benin plaques. Right, what do you remember? The civilization that made it was very modern and they were just as cultured as our own. Good. But he was just realizing that. Who was? Um, the English person in the museum, I don't know. Which museum? In British Museum. This very British. museum, right, yes. He said he's, it's got to be like African. It's because it's got African textures. African people into it. The professor seemed a bit shocked. shocked. Yeah. So the chap from the British Museum was shocked. Yeah, he didn't think that, that it was made by the African people. Yeah. Well, chaps, let's hope your knowledge of the Benin plaques is enough to defeat the Dark Lord. We must now make our final journey to face him. I can sense the dark forces descending on the Great Court. We'll have to go this way. Follow me. <laughs> Time. Right, this is it. This is your final battle. I just need to summon the Dark Lord. <sighs> the moon shines bright and darkness reigns. I bring three children here again. Their minds are sharp, the vision's seen. Dark Lord, awake! We challenge thee! Agatha! You dare to challenge me with these children? They're no match for me! Actually, I think you may well have met Silence! Them. Do you really think they have the knowledge to defeat me? What do you think, chaps? Yes! 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 yes. yes. As you wish, let the battle commence! Three visions you have seen about a relic held within these walls. I shall ask you questions about what you have seen. Three correct answers will earn your freedom, and you will become guardians of the museum. Three incorrect answers, and you shall never leave. You will become relics yourselves, and remain here for all time. Natasha, step forward. Good luck. Your first question. What are the Benin plaques made from? Molten brass. Let us see. They're making something from molten brass. Yes. Leave and prepare for your next question. Very well done. We need two more answers right. Your second question. Vanessa, approach. Oh, oh. 
What is the name given to a ruler of Benin? Orba! Let us see. What is it? An image of the Oba, their ruler. Yes. You still need one more. Prepare for your next question. Jolly good work. Your third question. Stacy, step forward. Who at first did the museum expert think made the Benin plaques? I forgot it. <laughs> you being? You are being. And your answer? I can't remember. No, you can do it, Stacy. Oh, I remembered. The Europeans. Let us see. These can't have been made in Africa. They must be European. Yes! <laughs> no! Well done, team! Look! No! Your knowledge of the Benin plaques has defeated the Dark Lord. You are now guardians of the museum. And as such, you are to be awarded with this. The Golden Scarab. These amulets are awarded to only those few who prove themselves worthy on a night such as this. Take them and look after them, for you never know when you shall be called on again. Ah, uh, but now it's dawn, I'm afraid, and it's time for you to leave. Stacy, Vanessa, Natasha, guardians of the museum, farewell. Yes! <laughs> My mind just went blank and I couldn't think of what I was going to say. I'm very happy about scarab beetle as well. I'm never going to lose that. I'm going to keep it forever. Hat Dark Lord, we kicked your butt. <laughs> oh, what a triumph! Three much deserved guardians of the museum and a defeated Dark Lord. Well, my work here is done. But if those dark forces should return, I might need your help. Until then, dear friends, following on. Do you have what it takes to become a guardian of the museum? Play the relic game and find out. Watch for clues and answer the quizzes correctly to return all the lost relics to the museum and print off your very own certificate. Go to the CBC website now! Getting to know your mum. We're not literally fighting each other. No, you've got to block it. Getting to know your dad. What are you touching us? What? Getting to know yourself. This is going to be tough. I would like to show everyone that I can do it. And mastering the ancient Japanese art of karate in just three weeks. <laughs> Karate Journey to Japan. Yay! Today at 5.15, the CBBC channel. Head over to the CBBC channel now for fun from the dumping ground, followed by action with all new High Karate Journey to Japan.